with just one note. So check this out. Now let's give it a try. Oh, I almost forgot. do anything. It just looks cool. Now let's play. It's a glass jar xylophone. La, 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 la. This is so fun. This jar plays a really high note. And this jar plays a really low note. And these jars play the notes in between. Hoo. Ooh. Hey, it's Ollie! Hello, Manny! Ho! Ho! 
playing water jars, are you? Hi, Ollie. I made my own xylophone out of jars, and it's so much fun. Those jars are fun. It's true. I know a whole story about jars, too. Listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Pepe, come on, Pepe. You can do it. <gasps> there you go. <laughs> See, it wasn't so scary. Here's your food. Oh, Pepe. Oh, hey, friends. I'm Carrie, and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. And we are trying to get our tiny little friend, Pepe, to eat some lunch. But he's a little afraid. <laughs> Which reminds me of today's true story. Are you ready? <laughs> Stormy's ready. And hopefully Pepe will get ready, because here we go. Today's true story from the Bible begins with a man named Gideon. One day, God told Gideon to take his army and go battle the Midianite army. Oh no, this made Gideon afraid because the Midianites were a really big army. No, a really, really big army. I mean a really, really, really big army. That's better. And Gideon's army was small. No, a really, really small army. I mean a really, really, really small army. That looks right. Gideon didn't think he should be the one in charge of the army. Are you sure you want me to lead the army, God? Gideon wondered. But Gideon trusted God and did what God told him to do. Well, what happened next is pretty awesome. Gideon told each soldier to take a trumpet, a torch, and a jar and to follow him. They snuck into the camp and when Gideon told them to, they blew their trumpets and broke the jars. And they shouted, for the Lord and for Gideon. Can you say that with me? Ready? For the Lord and for Gideon. Louder, for the Lord and for Gideon. <laughs> and just like that, the Midianites ran away. God's army had won. See, you're never too small to trust God. You can trust God and I can trust God. Hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can trust God? I can trust God. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Gideon trusted God, and so can you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, what a great story. Gideon trusted that God could use him to do something big, and he won the battle. And we can trust that God can use us too. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Gideon used jars to win the battle. I'm going to use these jars to play a song for my friends. I can even tell them about Gideon. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! God, I am not afraid. Psalm 56 11. I trust in God. I am not afraid. Psalm 56 11.